Ladies and gentlemen, um, as I promised you already, I'm uh, unfolding another scholarship from Canada. I see a lot of people asking me, oh, how, how, can I go, can, how can I go to Canada through uh, education? So this is another scholarship that you can take. So this scholarship, it is real. It is real 100%. So if you really do what it needs, I'm telling you, you, and you get it. And in this video, I'm going to be, I'm going to combine two scholarships from, from, from where? From, uh, from Canada. So guys, try to finish up the whole video so you can know which other scholarship is in Canada. You know, we have a lot of people there. We have a lot of people that, uh, all over the world who are educated, who want to proceed with their masters, with their PhD. So, but they do not know. So these can these um, these scholarships, by the way, they admit international people. They admit Canadians, um, citizens, and they admit. Um, um, permanent residents of Canadians. So, but the other viral uh, scholarship I showed you, for example, it is from Belgium, Belgium here, uh, it, it, is, it is from here, but it does not allow people from developed countries, and it does not allow from Belgium, from here, to apply. It only accepts only people from the developing countries but this scholarship if you are in if you are ugandan and you are in canada you can do this scholarship if you are a, a nigerian and you, you are in canada with a, a permanent resident you can take on this scholarship okay so guys the opportunities out there but you do not know how to get the correct ones still they are fake they are also fake what scholarships out there but I'm here to screen for you. How do I screen? I first go deeper and investigate on this. I get to know, do I know anyone who applied this scholarship and got it? If I say that, yes, there is someone who applied for a scholarship and got it, got, got the scholarship and came and studied, and I see the degree, then I will, I will always bring that scholarship to you. So now I'm in Canada soon, I'm, I'm going to UK, okay? I'm going to America, I'm going to Australia, I'll be bringing you all the scholarships all over the world and explain to them and I give you the tactics on how to get them. For example, this scholarship, who can apply? Okay, who can apply? The requirements. Those are requirements. You see? Who can apply? You need a statement of leadership. What is a statement of leadership? It is, it is also, um, it is also um, uh, equivalent to a motivation. You need a motivation. You need a research net application form uh -huh. for researchers. You can go deeper. And research about it. You need two recommendation letters. Okay. Recommendation letters. Those recommendation letters should be gotten from academia. You can get one from acad from your boss, your current boss, and maybe another one from your lecturer, the former lecturer. In he in a research proposal, you need also a research proposal. For example, you need to show. I mean, you have to go and see. For example, if you want to take a PhD, you you need to go deeper and see the types of PhDs they have. What types of PhDs? Because when you come here like this, you see that they offer PhDs. You see? They offer PhDs, they offer masters. So you need to go and see which PhDs do they offer. Then from there, you need to, to base on that to write a what? A good motivation. So guys, re learn to read. Everything is always on this website, how to apply and what is needed. Guys, I've been always educating you on how to get, um, you, you see, 
you need a reference from uh, to the project. You need ref references to the project. You need transcripts. These transcripts must be certified. I have been teaching you how uh, how to certify your transcript from the university. You need to go to the university and they put there a stamp from the university. You need a CV. A CV must be up to date. Guys, most of you guys, you do not know how to make CVs. We are still on the other old CVs. One day I will come here and teach you how to make a, a very clean CV. So, as I promised that today, I'm going to, de uh, you see, application process. For example, for this one, it is still open. I saw somewhere here. It is still open. Guys, you can grab this. You see? You can grab this. November 2020. The deadline for applying this is June 20. So it means if it is if they haven't updated it, June 2030. 20, 20, but if they up, you know sometimes they don't apply they don't update. But it means the deadline now for this year has just expired. June June, it has just expired actually. No, it has been updated. It has just expired. It means if you need now to apply, you need to wait from this from which month? From November. Guys, I told you always in November, that's when the calls when they call. That's, that's when the, the calls are open until 31st of June. So, but the other one I told you it ends um it ends March. It ends February. The other one, I, I, I um, the, the other one from my previous video. But this one, it ends 31st June, 30th June. So, guys, every 30th June, this scholarship is gone. So, as I promised, I'm going to, to bring you another scholarship. It is here. This is a scholarship where my brother, my real brother, uh, got his PhD. He did a PhD with this and it takes a lot of people from Africa. So it is called to do foundation. So when you come here like this, you will see, guys, don't, don't limit your chances. These things are possible. A lot of people, I'm telling you, my brother went through the same scholarship. So this scholarship, it is offered by the by the what? By the government of what? Of 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 um, it is offered by the government of Canada. So when you come here like this, guys, get learn to read, okay? Learn to read. You see, go here like this. Read, read, read. Trust me, you get all the information that you need, okay? So, our theme, human rights, responsibility, responsible citizen, Canada and the world, uh, people and their natural environments. Guys, when you go here, you find a lot of information. And I would, and I would encourage everyone to do what to you see when you click here you see scholarships for example when you come here like this you see there is there is a what there is information you see when you come here but at, at, at this moment all calls are closed guys visit this website you see this website you see see it this website you see this website visit it during november the calls will be there but right now go ahead and read more about it you see when you click here you see scholarships, you see mentor, you see fellow, you see leadership development, you see all the themes and scientific circles. So, guys, 
for example this is alumina let me let me let me see if i can find my my brother let me see if i can find my brother my brother should be among the alumina because he's a prominent guy i don't know let me see if i can find him should be there oh let me search for him let me try to search for him let me search let me search for him if okay i think he's not there so he is not there but what i'm trying to mean that you guys here you can find all sorts of information you can find all sorts of information so i'll just encourage everyone if you have a brother you have a sister who want to go to Canada for further education, who want to go to Canada to do PhD, who want to go to Canada to do a master, especially you guys who are in leadership, political science, um, governance. So please, guys, this is the best way to get your, you see? This is the best way to do what? To do, to get a correct uh, a, um, what scholarship this one i know it because my brother studied on it my real brother so guys i'll be unveiling every day some new scholarships and some new uh, i mean some correct scholarships and collect what conferences for you guys to um or of different countries either from Canada, America, USA, Europe, Australia, I'll try my I'll commit myself that I'll be doing a lot of research. I will never post something that I'm not sure I'm not sure of. So, for now, this is the website for this. You see? Go ahead and read and understand. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Sh share it. Share it. You never know you can be blessed with someone. And like. Thank you so much.